Well, Tom, there is bad news for some kids and many adults who don't like needles. A CDC expert panel says people should not use the popular nasal flu vaccine during the upcoming flu season. So why the change and what should parents do now? The Fox Medical Team's Beth Galvin has the story. The CDC's immunization advisory panel says the data shows the flu mist nasal flu vaccine doesn't work and it hasn't really worked for the last three flu seasons. About 30% of U.S. children get this needle free vaccine and now their parents are going to have to find another option. For years, the needle free flu mist vaccine seemed like a godsend to parents with children nervous about needles. A puff of medication up the nose and you were protected. Good or girl. maybe not. It's clear that the vaccine used to work really, really well and sometimes better than the shot. But CDC epidemiologist Dr. Joe Brissy says for the last few years, research shows the flu mist nasal spray hasn't provided much, if any, protection against the seasonal flu, although no one is sure exactly why. According to the latest data from the 2015-2016 flu season, in children between the ages of 2 and 17, the nasal flu vaccine was only 3% effective. That's compared to the shot, which was 63% percent effective in the same group. And that's why late Wednesday, an expert panel known as the Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices voted that the flu mist should stop being used for the coming 2016-2017 flu season. For the kids or the parents who like nasal vaccines, who like the spray, I'm sorry, uh, but a shot is better than getting the influenza uh, virus itself. MedImmune, flu mist manufacturer, has produced 14 million doses for the upcoming flu season. That's about 11 percent of the total vaccine supply in the U.S. and represents about a third of all vaccine given to kids. One of the big challenges is that many providers have already ordered their vaccine for the 2016-2017 flu season and doctors like pediatricians are going to have to go back to the drawing board to figure out how to get more flu vaccine, the injectable kind, to up to a third of their patients who preferred the flu mist. The CDC says it is confident there will be enough injectable flu vaccine to go around this fall, but the question is whether children and adults will be willing to brave the shot. Flu can be a serious disease, especially in kids, and so it's more important to get your kid vaccinated. Even if they don't want a shot, a shot's better than getting the flu. The CDC recommends a yearly flu shot for all Americans six months and older, and this means now for the time being, all of us will have to get the shots because there will be no flu mist. For the Fox Medical Team, I'm Beth Galvin.